Warning, this game contains jump scares, flashing lights, scary and disturbing content. Red Mist. What is up you guys, Realistic Gaming here, today we are here on Red Mist. Now if you guys don't know what Red Mist, it's a creepypasta based on Squidward. Red Mist is an alternate character version of Squidward and Spongebob which pertains in Random Land. Huh? Which Spongebob does visit in one of the episodes. And if you did not know what Red Mist Squidward looks like, he looks a little something like this. Yeah, he looks pretty terrifying, right? Alright, so with that being said, let's go ahead and jump straight into this and let's see how it goes. Story. On 7th January 2000, Squidward was found dead in his house by his friends Spongebob and Patrick. The Bikini Bottom Police started an investigation but could not find any evidence of a possible murderer and assumed it was a suicide as the gun was in one of Squidward's hands. A few days later, Spongebob and Patrick were reported missing, last seen entering Squidward's house in the middle of the night. As the Bikini Bottom police continued the investigations, a secret cellar door was unveiled in Squidward's house. Oh man, that is one quite terrifying story and it says you play as one of the police officers of Bikini Bottom police. You have to enter the cellar will you unveil the truth. I don't know man, I don't know if I want to get mixed up in this business. Hint, your stamina is limited, use it when needed. Well, thanks for the hint. Okay, oh, okay, so now we're in Squidward's cellar, it appears like. Okay, what's up with all these cans? Why is there so many cans? Is it like canned beans or something? Okay, that is the way we came in, so... We go forward, let's go down this hallway. Dude, it's so dark down here. <laughs> I do not want to be down here, man. Why did they assign me to this? <laughs> Come on. Okay, uh... Dude, it's so dark. Okay, let's just keep on walking. And it did say to uh, save your stamina. So let's not try to waste it because we will be needing it later. Okay, can we turn our light off? We can't. Okay, so on the top right it says item zero out of seven. Okay, what is this, a record? Playing some scary music. What's well, not scary, but this is like some creepy vibes. <laughs> Especially being down here by yourself. Okay, uh, so we're supposed to find seven items, but what the heck are we supposed to find, man? Alright, uh, I don't see anything over here. There has to be something in lane here. I mean, we do have to find seven things. Okay, maybe behind here. Oh! Oh, it's that, it's that painting! Ah. Okay, so we found one out of seven. Okay, so far so good. We just need six more. Hopefully there's no jump scares. Oh, what is that? Dude, is that SpongeBob's leg? <laughs> what happened to SpongeBob? Uh, SpongeBob? Okay, so it did say that SpongeBob and Patrick came down here to the cellar and they were never seen again. So it seems like we kind of have an idea what happened to SpongeBob as his leg is just there. It's on the ground, man. It's covered in blood. Oh no, poor SpongeBob. I wonder what he got himself into. Oh, is this a clarinet? Dude, is this Squidward's clarinet? It was a clarinet. Okay, so now we have two out of seven items. Oh man, okay, we need five more. Dude, this cellar is humongous. So much space down here. Okay, there's so many boxes. I have a feeling there might be something here, maybe not. I don't know, we better not ju uh, get jump scared though. Okay, nothing. Oh, what's this? A spatula. Oh! Okay, we got a nice spatula. Is that Spongebob spatula? Might be, might not. Who knows? Okay, there is... Okay, left or right, left or right. Let's go left and then we'll come back this way. He was... He was what? He was who? He was, dude, Spongebob's other leg. Oh! There's a jump scare. It kind of looks like, like it was Squidward. Dude, is that Spongebob? He was wrong? Dude, he tore off his legs and his arms. Oh, there's a shell. Okay, we got four items now. Dude, my boy. Oh my God. Man, Spongebob needs some milk, bro. Oh my God, he literally tore off his leg and his arms. So as we know, um, Red Miss Squidward is not joking around and he will murder you 
if you get the chance. All right, well, it was nice knowing you, SpongeBob. I feel so bad for him. He was such a great guy. He was always jolly and happy. Oh. What is that? I hear like, <gasps> dude, I see a shadow. That looks like Squidward. Oh, Squidward. He disappeared. SB129. Oh, what the heck was that? Okay, I don't know what that was, but that was freaky, dude. Okay, so, oh, look, SpongeBob's hat. Or it might be Squidward's hat. Dude, there's a pot of blood here. SB129. What is that? Is that like SpongeBob episode 129 or something? Is that what it stands for? I'm, I don't know. I'm just making things up right now. Okay, so. Hopefully we don't get, uh, we don't get tracked down by Squidward and he slaughters us. Alright, we need two more items. Dude, what's up with all this shelving here? Okay, there might be something here. Let's look at the shelves because we don't want to miss an item. <gasps> Is that? Dude, I think that's Patrick. Like one of his limbs. Oh, we found SpongeBob. Now we found Patrick. And yes, that is definitely Patrick. Dude, it's his head. He cut off Patrick's head. <laughs> oh man. All right, let's keep on going. What's up with these cans? I don't know, dude. I feel like they might. Oh, it made a noise. Why did the can make a noise? Okay, maybe you have to click the cans and uh, Maybe it's like an easter egg or something. Oh, what's down here? Oh, this is a jellyfish net. I wonder who that belongs to. Okay, we have six items, dude. We need one more. Okay, there's a hallway down here. Oh my god. Freaking jump scare. Oh, Patrick. Stop. Dude, what happened to Patrick? He legit nailed him up here and he cut off his head as we seen it back there. Oh, and this is the last item. Six out of seven. Okay, uh... Is there anything else back here? I have a feeling these cans have something, bro. Oh, what if the cans are a reference to, uh... You see, it did a noise again. What if it's a reference to the canned beans? <laughs> I don't know, man. It's just a, a, an assumption, you know? Okay, we have all our items though. Poor Patrick. So I guess we turn back and we go towards that hallway. Here goes nothing, man. Wait, I see some writing on the wall. Truth is near. All right, it seems like we're about to find out the truth and what happened down here. Just as soon as we get out. Oh my God. As soon as we get out of here. Dude, that red mist Squidward looks freaky, yo. It kind of looks like Slenderman. Oh, what the heck is that? No, no. Oh, my stamina's gone. No, I'm dead, yep. I'm dead. I'm dead. I must have wasted my stamina without even realizing. Death ending. After you have uh, not returned from the basement, the Bikini Bottom Police decided to send a special force of police officers into the basement. They found the bodies of SpongeBob, Patrick, and you in a devastating condition. An investigation was started to explain the deaths, but no clues were found to what really happened. The case was closed a few months later, and the deaths remain a mystery to this day. <laughs> Man, I wasted my stamina without even knowing. I'm gonna retry to do it because I did collect all the things and this is death ending so there might be multiple endings from what it seems like all right so before I got to this part again I was clicking all the cans and I I think it was a total of three cans that made a noise when you click on them so I don't know what that means oh yeah so we're back to this part when we get chased by the red mist squidward giant floating head yep there he is run 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 come on this is where you use all your stamina Dude, come on! Oh, dude, that thing is freaky! Come on, dude, do not stop! Oh, I see the ladder! That is our way out! Come on! Oh, and... Yes, we made it! Oh, please stand by. Wait. 
What? We're back in the hallway. Okay, this is strange. Oh, I see something. It's like a door. Mr. Krabs did it. Oh man, what's up with that music? <laughs> okay, so it's SB129. Bro, what the heck is this? Past, present. SB129 ending. When you were when you entered SB129, you were teleported on the day of the Squidward assassination. You caught Mr. Krabs in the act when he tried to shoot Squidward. You overpowered and arrested Mr. Krabs. He was sentenced to prison for attempted murder for 25 years. To be continued? So Mr. Krabs trying to kill Squidward? For what reason? Like what's the reason behind that? <laughs> oh man. Oh, did you hear that music? That's some creepy pasta music right there. So it says to be continued. So there might be more to this, like a part two explaining why why Mr. Krabs tried to kill Squidward. I don't know, man. Just kind of leaves us there, like wondering what the heck happened. All right, so I guess that is it. Yep. Okay, that's that's the end of the game. All right, you guys. Well, that was Red Mist. Let me know what your favorite creepy pasta is down in the comments below because I know there is a lot of creepy pastas as there is like SCPs and all that stuff. All right, you guys. Well, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the main support. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to slap the like button, subscribe, and turn that notification bell on. And I will see you on the next one. <laughs>